hello guys welcome back to my channel my name is eva anthony and i'm here today to show you how i'm going to do this whole makeup in 15 minutes like i'm in a hurry and i decided to just film this this very fast um makeup tutorial for you all for those that might be going to work or those that might be going to school you can actually wear this natural look to anywhere like, it would i think i'm going to put up a timer up here so that you we all can like time this whole this whole makeup um session so so the first thing we're going to be doing is to use a hand sanitizer i'm very sure everybody knows what this is for considering what is out there so you actually want to do this like it's very very important whenever to actually sanitize your hands because it's going to your face and all of that so the next thing I'll be using is my Rimmel Stay Matte Mattifier. I'll be applying it on all the places that I would normally produce oil. For foundation, I'll be using the Hegai and Esther Photo Perfect Foundation in the shade Coffee. This is the part that literally takes most of the time your face. I feel like most times I feel like when I finish my face, I I can actually use like two to three minutes or or less for my eyes and my lips. So we just need to concentrate on the face more because we actually want a very smooth canvas I feel like blending is the hardest of everything because blending actually takes most of your time because you have to blend 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 to actually come out with a very very flawless flawless face so The next thing we'll be doing is to highlight and I'll be highlighting with the Pro Conceal Concealer in Chestnut. I'm not going to be going in with anything too light just because I want something that is a bit natural. So I'm just going to go with this very not so bright concealer. You can do whichever you feel comfortable with anyway. So I'm just going to blend it in. And while I'm blending it, I'm going to take it up to my eyelid. To set, I'll be setting with the S Fun Loose Powder in Translucent. To contour, I'll be using this dark shade from the V Beauty. I feel like powder powder contour is way faster than cream contour because with cream contour you have to blend, 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 blend until everything is perfect. But with powder contour, you can actually do away with less time and. So 
see how much time it took us to just finish the face like the face is the, the most important it takes more time and all of that so so the next thing i'll be doing is i'll be using the beauty line by Didi brow pencil to fill in my brows to be doing much on my brows i'm just going to fill it in and i won't i won't be cleaning or concealing anything you can if you want to it's totally optional So I'm just going to be feathering my brows and just fill it in basically. I'll be doing the same thing here. And for eyeshadow, I'm just going to be using the same dark shade I used as my contour. As my contour just to add a bit of color to my eyes that's basically the reason why I'm doing this So to line my eyes, I'm going to be using the Mabrook eyeliner. You can totally skip this step, but I love to line my brows, so hence, I do not want to skip this. So I'm just going to, oh my lord. For mascara, I'll be using the Zara Lengthening. For my lips, I'm going to be using the, the Classic Makeup USA Brow Pencil. Thank you for watching if there is a makeup tutorial that you would want me to put up on my channel you can as well put it down in the comment section give this video a thumbs up drop a comment share this video and definitely subscribe to my channel i'll see you in my next one